Welcome in to another Packers stream here. May or may not be our final season, uh, maybe even our final Packers stream here. Um, not making any executive decisions there. If you're watching this on TFG Plays or here on Twitch, let me know um, if you want to see the series keep going. If you're ready for something else, just... I'm a man of the people, so just... Just let me know what you're feeling. Um, for those of you that missed last stream, it just got uploaded onto YouTube. So if you don't want to watch this stream, that's fine. I'm about to spoil what happened at the end of our last stream. So just a little forewarning there. Plenty of time to opt out of the stream before we give you your spoilers on the series. But... Um, the 2020, technically 2024 season is underway here. Jordan Love opened up with a dominant start, looking looking excellent. A.J. Dillon, our lead back, Jerry Judy going off. Josiah DeGuara actually uh, four receptions for 94 yards despite being kind of in the mix with these other two tight ends. Um and then yeah just a dominant overall first win but we we actually lost in the playoffs in the nfc championship after a couple of really good games we lost to robert link's philadelphia eagles who went on to win the super bowl most of you are familiar with robert link the uh wow chase how did they get chase young interesting most of you are familiar with robert link who actually gets the Truz ability, uh, but from our Maryland Terp series, now a Super Bowl champion. Uh, but yeah, we lost to them, and then our offseason was nice. We Chase was a free agent. Okay, gotcha. Uh, our offseason was nice. We really didn't have a lot of cap space because we've had to start paying these guys, but we did finally get Perry Nickerson locked up on a... Uh, nice three-year special teams contract that was really all we did but some draft picks we brought in Braxton Calloway in the third round who looked pretty good in our first game our we actually traded out of the first round and ended up drafting Bob Schultz who is a hidden dev tight end we drafted him and we drafted um, George Winslow here, 90 speed linebacker, who we're actually starting. Um, also, Rashad Flynn, who I said was going to be a stud, ends up winning Defensive Rookie of the Year in the slot there. So, he's a rock star. Our cornerback group is just insanity. And, uh, under the radar, Matt Brothers, who we drafted like third or fourth round last year, actually has superstar development and is getting an opportunity to start this year. So exciting season here. We actually have a breakout for Jerry Judy to finally maybe go up to superstar X Factor. So we can substitute any play the moments opportunities we would have for uh, breakouts, which is what we're gonna do here, which means we're gonna play offense here this week. Panda, you looked up the closest Culver's and it's in Idaho? Dang, that's that sucks. So Jordan Love wins Offensive Player of the Week. When the Packers series ends, just stick with this franchise and switch over to the Eagles to play with Link. That'd be, uh, that'd be a fascinating idea. I don't mind that. We're definitely going to have to um, find something fun to do. We're getting into the dog days of summer here with football and Madden. Josh Myers continues to grow here. What's up, Ralph? Jordan Love's getting awful close to getting escape artist. Okay. 
Let's do it. This is one of our six play the moments. On the season. Oh, there's a car, uh, there's a car in midfield there. It's a good luck. Thanks, EA. I do still have to get rid of the blurb thing for channel points. Alright, we're, we're trying to feed Jerry Judy out here. There's a super, uh, superstar corner on him, though. Who is that? Darius Williams, actually. Nice. Drop that in a bucket there, love. Okay, Rogers. K1 Shorts facing me this game. I'm surprised he hasn't retired yet. Good start for Judy. Brooks is up to superstar for them. Is Trevor Lawrence a top 10 mobile QB in the NFL? I, I'm i not ready to say that, no. Lawrence is, has straight line speed, but he... Uh, in my opinion, is not a very, like, quick twitch athlete, so to speak. Apparently, Robert Kondice has been great in, C in Seahawks camp. He's definitely a believe it, I'll believe it when I see it player. <laughs> Dang it. Patrick Jones on the Seahawks. Oh. Quick turnover. Good job, defense. I think Mitch Trubisky is a career backup now, yeah. I mean, he'll probably start again at some point, but... I don't think anyone's gonna be like, oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna give Mitch Trubisky a uh, another opportunity to start. Oh, good play, fifty one. I'm kind of trying to get Judy a, a touchdown here, but might not be reasonable here. Wait, there's people in Chicago that still wanted Trubisky over Fields? Jesus. Some things just never change. Where does Mahomes rank among all NFL players? I think he's either second or third right now. Because Donald's won... And then I think him and Rodgers are kind of splitting hairs at the moment. Man, I don't know where Darius Williams was going on that one, but good job, Judy. He's well on his way. Loves in the zone chat. 
No game audio? Are you freaking kidding me? What is going on? I literally tested it before we went live. What the hell? I'm like officially getting really mad about this. Let me know if it's back. I, j I just don't know what the heck <laughs> is going on with that. I noticed it like wasn't there the entire stream last time, so that's great. It's too loud. Okay, we'll go, we'll go down a little bit. We are in Seattle, to be fair. Sherman going back to the Seahawks is seeming more and more likely. That's a fun fit. I'm down for that. Let's see, if we move Maxwell over here, does this change to an out route like that? Okay, no, it stays on the slant. Oh, what a throw from love. Dude, hang on. We got to see that replay. You like that? You like that? <laughs> That's sweet. That's a sweet angle right there. I believe that's what they call a seed. Oh, they gotta review it. Trubisky or Haskins? Trubisky. Trubisky, I can at least say with confidence, belongs on an NFL roster. I don't know if I can say the same about Haskins or not. Um, also, Marshawn Lattimore versus Mar Marlon ha Humphrey is not even close. Humphrey's, Humphrey's in a different conversation, in my opinion. There you go, love. Dude, Humph I, I didn't realize until I listened to the PFF podcast back, I didn't realize that Marlon Humphrey forced nine fumbles last year. That's just, I know he's good at it. I didn't realize it was nine. That's crazy. Yeah, I have no problem with saying Marlon is third behind Ramsey and Jair. It's probably either. Oh, come on. Deflected. That, those were Judy's yards right there. I would say for me it's between Humphrey and uh, Tredavis White. And still Gilmore. I mean, we'll see. Gilmore could have just had a down year or, or he could be regressing. It's one or the other. I would I wouldn't be the least bit surprised if Gilmore still had another elite season in him. Yeah. Come on, O line. Will the Dolphins pay Xavier Howard? I think they probably will, because usually teams fold and give in to superstar players. was open there but oh shoot <laughs> that was bad Jesus dude Judy just is so useless in contested situations <laughs> Oh, 
first interception on the season right there on third and long. There we go. That's much better. How many good years does Kirk Cousins have left? I mean, I, don't, I feel like Kirk could play for another five years. I, I don't think longevity is really an issue for for Kirk. Was Prime Stafford a top three QB in any given year? No. No, his best year he was maybe fifth. Dude, feed frickin' Jerry Judy, man. He's putting on a clinic. Uh, I'll be rooting for the Bucks in the finals. Next deep dive, I'm hoping will be out tomorrow. Kind of took the weekend off, if you couldn't tell, just streaming a lot. Which isn't necessarily taking the weekend off, but... This is chill, this is casual. We're having fun. <laughs> Out of context TFG quotes. I'm rooting for the Bucks. That's right. Man, we got to get Jerry Judy his breakout before. Uh, before this game becomes a blowout. What's my favorite PFF podcast? Mine's probably Sam and Steve, but I like all of them. The forecast, I have to kind of... Uh, listen in doses. It's a different, uh, it's a different vibe. All right, we're still in the in the zone here somehow. Thank you, Amari Rogers. Nice catch. Even better throw. Does Jonathan Abram have a future? I, I mean, I would hope he has some kind of future. <laughs> I don't know if it's a as a starting safety in the NFL. Oh, I should have hit that hole a little bit harder. No, I think. I mean, the expectations for her for him is that he can become a star safety. I think that ship has sailed. But he could become a good role player. He could become like a Tremaine Edmonds type. You know, Tremaine Edmonds was a first round pick as well that was overdrafted. But he's he's become a, a decent role player and a starter, just not a star. I think that would be Abrams' best case scenario. But yeah, I agree the Raiders shouldn't even start Abram. There's more upside in the guys they just drafted, and the, the guys they just drafted are probably better anyway. So what's the point of starting Abram? Who's gonna, if, he, if he clicks, you're going to have to pay him sooner. Oh! That's our rookie right there, Schultz. I think odds of a Gruden firing are quite low. I think he's he would need to miss the playoffs in two straight years, I think, to get fired. I was about to send that thing. Oh, what a play. Wow. All 
Alright, what's Judy at? 154. We need another 46 yards. Could get it on this crossing route right here. Dang it. The blitz got in. Judy was coming wide open on that. What was my Felipe Franks comp? I don't know if I had one for Franks. I, I don't do a comp for every single player, especially when you get into day three guys. Oh no. That came up way short. It was not a good look by me, but I was trying to put that in the back right corner of the end zone and uh, <clears throat> Love had other ideas there. Oh well. Oh, that was nice. That was nice. I like it. What will Burrow's outlook be if he gets hurt again? Like another, I mean, it would need to, in order to change his outlook, it would need to be like another ACL injury that, to the point where it's like, okay, his knees just won't hold up. Anything else, I feel like he'd be, he'd still overcome it. Dang it. Is that Taven Bryant? Oh, Matt Ioannidis. I thought we could for sure run away from him. Apparently not. Alright, Judy, where are you at? This route never works in Madden. Can we get him a corner route, maybe? <laughs> I'm just lucky that wasn't picked. That was forcing it, but I kind of need to force it if he's going to get the uh, X Factor. Come on, Judy. All right, there's there's some yards. 166. We need another 34, chat. Jeez, Foster Moreau. Dude just can't stay healthy for us. Is that Ionitis again? Let's see what they do there. They accepted it. Ah. Okay, Judy, you got this. Woo! Oh, let's go. That's going to do it. That's a superstar breakout right there. That was nuts. You can't cover him, baby. And now we, we have achieved it, so we're done. Jordan Lava already has like a thousand yards. Does it matter the nine the fines that the Niners, Jags, and Cowboys got? No, it doesn't make a difference. They do uh they did have practice time taken away though. 
which is probably more significant. I have more faith in Sam Darnold than Drew Locke, easily. It's not even, not even close. Look at that. Ooh, and 5,000 XP. That'll play, that'll play. I'm just going to go ahead and do... We're just going to go with the EA class this year. I'm just going to go full-on auto-scout. If we make it to the draft, that'll be great. If not, so be it. Not a lot of big names up this year, which is nice. Kenny Clark, pay this man whatever he needs. The rest of these dudes, probably going to let him go. Maybe we pay Maxwell. Myers has been decent. How many NFL stadiums have I been to? Let's see. I've been everywhere but Detroit in the NFC North. I've been to Cleveland. And I think that's it. I think just four. But this year we're going to we're going to Cincinnati for a Bengals game. So we got to pick a new um, we got to pick an ability for Judy. Since this stadium is terrible, uh, we're going to have fun. I mean, how bad could it be? I've been to Cleveland, Chicago. Grab and smash. Oh, that's not Jerry Judy. We're going to go with Ankle Breaker because that feels correct. I'm going to change. I'm just going to change him up a little bit. All right. So Detroit's 2 and 0, but I think I'll sim this one. Thirty-five, thirty-one. The offense keeps rolling. Okay, our left tackle goes down for. What's up, John Laduca? Left tackle goes down for a few weeks. So Freeman's gonna step in there. We got the bye week. Jeez, bunch of upgrades on the buy. So Chambers, I'm continuing to develop his run, run defense. And maybe he'll stay cheap enough that we can keep him around as a third guy. SoFi is a stadium. Absolutely. Although they haven't played a game there, right? Bob Schultz. Just keep getting better, Matt Brothers. Man, Brandon has been uh, definitely good, but for an X-Factor, he has not really been a difference maker for us. OK, 
Hey, we're three and one. We got a good Washington football team this week. They've been kind of in and out of the playoffs. So maybe we should do play the moments this week. What? Big first quarter drive and they're going to let us play? What even is this? Letting us play offense in Madden? I... Oh, Dylan. That is not what... I thought he was running, running an out there, but... That was beautiful. Which team in my power ranking so far is most likely to go to the playoffs? Uh, the Bears. The most recent one we did. Bears and Broncos. It, it goes in order for a reason. <laughs> Going for it. Oh, we got hit while we threw. I was trying to go for a big, big Schultz on that one. I guess schedule, schedule would would impact the whole going in in order thing, but. Oh, Jace. Is there a chance Briley more starts for the Titans? Probably not week one, but he could get there. You know I'm a big Briley Moore stand. Perfect scheme fit. It's funny how... Uh, Nighthawks Josh Rosen has changed our standards for what a, a dominant that franchise guy rebuild quarterback looks like. Because Jordan Love's been good, but relative to uh, Nighthawks Rosen, he has not been uh, on the same level. Good to see Judy, though, is finally living up to his height. <laughs> if it isn't Nighthawks Rosen, I don't want him. Jeez, they just, they can't cover him. Let's go. Let's go. What a play. First half stats for Jordan Love. Look at that. Come on, Big Bob Schultz. Foster Moreau. Oh no, Kendall, Kendall Fuller picked us off. Although it keeps us in the zone through play the moments. What's up, Nixter? I'm not sure how long we're going for this one. Oh my gosh, what a throw by Love. What was that?
keep feeding him. Nighthawks Rosen or IRL Rogers? I think Nighthawks Rosen is better than the current Rogers. I don't know if he's better than uh, like 2011 Rogers. Oh, interesting. You can, you can tell them which. What is this flick? I don't even know what that's all about. Hmm. I thought for a second that meant you could change. That's the uh, gambler working working for us there. I thought for a second that meant you could change where they go on the offense or option route. First down. Oh, I changed it up to play all offense in there, didn't I? I didn't even realize I did that. M factors? What are M factors, chat? I've never heard that. Love is uh, 88, Robert. 88 overall. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna. Dang. Oh. They're the uh, momentum factors. Gotcha. Yeah, those things are. Iffy. <laughs> Late hit, ref. But that's funny that you're saying that <laughs> the Chargers shouldn't have one because they're the Chargers. Yeah, I think you'll be able to turn them off. Madden's been pretty good about giving options on stuff like that. I think this game's pretty well in control, chat. I think I'm just gonna sim. Knicks are gonna set us up with the voting. I like it. I don't know if this Packers team's gonna lose. We're working on an undefeated season right now. Thanks, Bulldog. I don't think I've ever worn this shirt on stream before. So Love throws one pick in simulation, but he is easy front runner for MVP right now and Judy also is like just dunking on the league is dominating. Look at Judy. Sheesh. Judy could go for 2,000. Let's see if we can get, to, get Judy to 2,000. That'd be sick. Hi, Teddy. Hi, stream star doggo. Breakout player. Who is it? AJ Dillon, huh? Let's get it. That'd be superstar for him. Come here. Hi, big guy. Here. Teddy Cam. Uh, hatchet. Let's just play the backup. That's okay. Josh Parsons. Remember him? Yeah, do the X-Factor as the vote, Nixter. 
Harris or, or DeAndre Swift? Najee Harris for me. Had a higher grade. Swift could have a better year, though. Swift could outproduce him this year. Wouldn't be surprised there. I mean, don't get me wrong. They were both my number one running back in the last two years, but Harris was... Harris was, was dominant. All right, so this is our third play the moment thing with all these breakouts. Ooh. Lucky Lannister, what's up, man? That's what I was going to say. We haven't seen you for a while, but... Uh, because you're, you've been trying to catch up. That was like my first thought when I saw you, Lucky Lannister. I was like, hey, it's been a while. And then it makes sense that you've been trying to catch up. Oh, good tackle, good tackle. It's good to see you. Is that game audio still working, chat? Dang. sound effect is something. Man, look at Perry Nickerson. We just got to spring Dylan loose. He's loose. Gosh, that'd be a great soundbite to get. The Paul Allen, Adrian Peterson run. He's loose. Dang, Hawk boy, you're going big on this breakout, huh? Oh, what a play! What a play! I mean, if we can just get him some touchdowns, too, that'll work. We're going to flip this out to the right side. Oh, no way. We got to make sure we get, get this reviewed. That is probably my favorite soundbite. That's an elite soundbite. There you go, Dylan. That's what you're here for. <laughs> What's up, Fallout Kid? Can't even be mad about it. Oops, Kylan Hill's in there. Quick. 
Can we get a little uh, screen for... For AJ? There we go. Oh, Kyle Pitts. Kyle Pitts over Hawkinson. No, no disrespect to Hawkinson, but Pitts is Pitts is different. Dang it! Got pushed out of bounds. I would think Sewell would have been the number one tackle last year. Ahead of Andrew Thomas would be my guess. Dang, Kylan Hill. I like the fight. What's the least deep position in the NFL? Probably tight end. Dude, I don't know how Amari Rodgers got that wide open. <laughs> but... Jesus. I saw that. I was like, is that a wide receiver out there? How did he get so open? Gun to my head. Does a QB go number one overall next year? Um, I could see it being a non-number one QB season. Um, gun to my head. I would not bet on that, but... Because a QB goes number one, like every eight years or eight out of ten years so that'd be just a bad mathematical decision on my end but oh man we're gonna have to get this for Dylan with like touchdowns because lines are shutting down Dylan just collecting heads. Somewhere Dan Campbell watches AJ Dillon run and he is just drooling. Best party food for the 4th of July? I'm always a fan of like pulled pork sandwiches, like a barbecue pulled pork mix. Can't go wrong with burgers. Yeah, basically Nick Stir. Anything you can throw on a grill. Brats. Dogs. Anything, man. It's all good. <laughs> Ooh, Amari Rogers. <laughs> Dog, he put the team on his back. Jeez, this is a good game. Detroit is coming alive. Thanks for the follow, Dead Soul. Oh, he missed him. Damn. 
He's going to get some easy yards here. Come on, Dylan. I need you to break one off. Almost. They got Andrew Van Ginkle in the uh, Matt Patricia hybrid 3-4 defense. I love it. The more things change, the more things stay the same, right? Teddy is laying on, you ever see those bins at Target that have like a little thing you can, uh, it's like a storage bin, but it's also a footrest. That's, that's what that is. Super common for like college dorms. I think everyone had one at some point. Didn't realize how poor the Bears secondary could be this year. Yeah. Their corner situation's rough. Where's Dwayne Brown amongst tackles? He's in the 10 to... He's in the 10 to 20 range. He's good. Good solid tackle. Not a top 10 guy, but... I watch a lot of YouTube. They're dominating this run game. We're getting two yards of carry right now. Right now I'm watching, it's super nerdy, but I'm watching Mass Effect lore videos. It's just a good, like, casual, casual listen. Perfect. Down at the one. That's exactly what we need here. There we go. All right, that's two. got in hot there. Get there. Ah, uh, I should have floated it. Where does Prime Le'Veon Bell rank among RBs? That's a good question. Um, it's tough because the second we saw him play behind a non-elite offensive line for two different teams, he was just really mediocre, and that was always a part of his style was his patience was such a good complement to the offensive line. And I know you can say that about any running back, but it seemed a little more exaggerated with Le'Veon Bell because he was never like a truly explosive player. He was more of a... Not even finesse, just like patience and power. So probably not top ten for Le'Veon. Come on! Oh wow, we're gonna get a bailout. I 
think you gotta go with Elijah Moore over Rondell Moore. But I like them both. Callaway, baby! He's doing A.J. Dillon a huge favor. Callaway has now been twice tackled within the two-yard line. Run it back. They got a full-on LeGarrette Blunt game here. There it is. Yeah, I was actually thinking about that, talking about David Montgomery for the Bears deep dive, how uh, kind of Le'Veon Bell-esque. Not quite as good, but... Ooh, this is brutal. 21 for 37. Uh, not really Bulldog, to be honest. I don't, I don't even think I really have access to that stuff. I don't even know how far back Game Pass goes, to be honest. Craft a modern Legion of Boom. That's a, that's a fun experiment. Uh, experiment? Well... You gotta have your Michael Bennett roll, right? So I think I'd go Joey Bosa for my Michael Bennett roll. That bigger bodied. Actually, no, Miles Garrett. Miles Garrett for the the Michael Bennett roll. You gotta have your Bobby Wagner. So I guess Bobby Wagner can. Uh, we'll we'll just hand it back to Bobby Wagner. Um, you gotta have your your cam chancellor, so I'll give that to Derwin James. You gotta have your Earl Thomas, so I'll give that to Jesse Bates. You gotta have your press corner, so Jalen Ramsey. Oh no, I thought he was gonna run the out route there. It's okay. And then a complimentary number two corner with some length that's not too expensive. Your Brandon Browner. How about um, come on, Taguara? Who would that be? Xavier Rhodes. Xavier Rhodes. Everything, everyone else is just a uh, role player starter. Now, William Jackson's too expensive. I, I think Xavier Rhodes, final answer. I guess you should have your complimentary KJ Wright linebacker, too. So, someone not too expensive, but good, a veteran. Dude, Callaway tackled at the two-yard line again. Unfortunately, I guess yeah, KJ Wright and Bobby Wagner can just be can just be the linebackers there. That's totally fine. That's a good point. Oh, keep running that route, MBS. We got to get another touchdown for Dylan. Field goal doesn't do anything for us anyway. We're going to go for it.
Damn it. Ooh, they scored. Come on, Dylan, just get a breakaway touchdown for us. No, we need four touchdowns, Lucky Lannister. One's got a shot. Man. KJ Dillon, the ball carrier. He's taken down at the 33 yard line. It's a gain of a yard. And it's third down. Come on, A.J. Dillon. You thought four TDs were Superstar X. I mean, maybe you're right. You could be right. Oh, sick. It's only three for Superstar? Okay, good. I read that wrong, then. Man, it's going to be fun to have A.J. Dillon. He's locked up, too. He's, he's only making, like, five per year. We either get to go arm bar or the truck one. A couple of offensive linemen are down now. GG's Detroit, GG's. Oh, it's actually Frank Wright for Detroit. That was a fun game. Keep them coming, love. One more. Let's go. Bring in the bulldozer. Okay, we got three play the moment games left and a full offense left. Dude, should we just go? Let's go Jerry Judy Scorched Earth this week. He's frustrated. I don't know why he's frustrated. He's freaking going off. But let's go. Let's play offense against the Raiders and just go absolutely Scorched Earth. I don't know if they have a better defense by now, but I'm going to bank on them not having a better defense considering they're we need a speed boost here for Harvey Alford. Because he is slow as heck. So we can go truck. Let's go truck, bulldozer. What's the what's the bet this week?
There's the truck stick, guys. <laughs> Actually got is that little tennis superstar and someone up there at free safety. Oh, almost. The Raiders take over first and yeah. All right, let's try this again. One yard line, though. Oh, my goodness. This is what we needed last week. I think that free safety might be John LaDuca. Yep. Our Maryland legend. Oh, gosh. Took so long to climb the pocket there. <laughs> Gus Bradley is their... <laughs> is, their def is their head coach. Gruden got fired. Gosh. Come on. This defense is, is mad that we decided to light them on fire because it's playing well. Jeez. Jonathan Abram, too. Damn. The Raiders. Gus Bradley's defense. Making us look silly, shutting us out in the first quarter. Get there. Oh. Oh my gosh, where did that guy come from? We're seeing ghosts. Jesus, throw it in front of him. One for six? What is happening, chat? Oh, my goodness. What the heck is, is happening? All right. Come on. I don't know if this is just scripted or what. They got a sniper on the third level, apparently. Dude, what the fuck? They're playing lockdown coverage on Jerry Judy. This has to be scripted. Dude just turns around on a dime and picks it off. Number 
Yeah, they heard me talking trash, and they're like, Watch this. Oh my god. Dude, he totally anticipated that. John LaDuca. This is like, I'm playing a, a user right now. Dude, he totally like baited me for that. Do you see him jump that? Comeback starts now. Three interceptions in the first half. Damn. <laughs> We're going to come back and win this, though. Just need our defense to... I thought Judy might have stepped out there. Love's in the zone. Can't throw picks. There we go, there we go. Defense, come on, really? <laughs> 37 points? Late hit. And he gets out of bounds. Alright. Dude! Freaking wide open. Put it on him. Nice catch, Kylan Hill. Oh, gosh, catch the ball. Time out. If we come back and win this game somehow, it's going to be epic. But our defense has got to help us out. We need some quick stops. Dang. I just possession caught that to be safe, but we had an easy touchdown there. Come on. At least get rid of it. They are not making this easy, dude. Okay, Schultz, you got this. There we go. Whew. 
All right, we're back in. We get to double up. Dang. Should have re-signed Brady for the veteran comeback ability. <laughs> Dang, dude, just sit down where you were, Hill. I don't know why he he felt the need to run all the way upfield there. Nice check down. There you go, Kylan Hill. Dang. Dude, what the heck? Oh, dang. Terrible read by me. Uh, fourth, we're going to go for it. I trust. I trust us. I thought that flat defender was for sure going to go. This is ballsy, guys, but I think we can get it. Yep. Nice play. All right. I'm going to I should start going for 2 cuz we're going to need some points. The Packers will set up for the 2 point conversion. Thank you, Judy. Thanks for catching that. Okay, we got to stop, chat. We're we'll right back in this thing. I should have racked that. It's all right. Dude, Kylan Hill. Been a monster. God, that truck is so satisfying. Nice throw.
Oh. Oh man, we had it there. Damn. Okay, we'll just have to take the field goal. Was this game really 30 to nothing? Yeah, I'm not even I'm not even reading the uh, reading the chat right now. I'm I'm getting this comeback. Come on, D. Oh, let's go! A turnover. <laughs> We're gonna have the lead by the fourth quarter. Oh my God! What a pick. Oh, we gave it back, but we got it back. I love how Dylan has like more rushing yards on about a third of the attempts he had last week. God, we cannot connect on those corner routes, man. Oh, that's not what I called. Oh, well. It's a good play call either way. MVS. <laughs> Nixter is about to pop an energy drink and then this game and I haven't left my seat. Glad I can provide an adrenaline rush and entertainment. I mean, that was too easy. Max Crosby on Josiah DeGuara. Good job, defense. Dude, Kylan Hill has been super impressive out here. The fans can't believe it. Ooh, this could work. Blitz is on. What did I say? Oh, no! Dude! I'm in the zone, man. We, we read those blocks perfectly. But what's the penalty? Josh Myers holding. Damn, dude. That sucks. Amari Rogers, baby. Nice. There's a sack. Also, it's Dan Quinn, not Gus Bradley. I'm still convinced they're the same person. Has anyone actually seen Dan Quinn and Gus Bradley at the same place at the same time? Jeez. Sacks.
Okay, the field goal will make it a two-score game. I should have kept going for two. Great kick, though. All right, defense, come on. Get us a stop. Ooh, they got us a stop. Big Bob. Hmm. Good play. play <laughs> two score game technically I'm not wrong it is if if each score was one point it'd be a two score game dang it I was just trying to find a way out of that pocket there's nothing I'm gonna let uh, Kylan Hill do some talking here Although that original route might actually be better than running it. Oh, he gets caught up. What is this crap? What the fuck? Literally the one route we were we were leaning on there was Kylan Hill. And <laughs> he gets stuck. That's okay. Thanks, EA. Oh, they got Blake Cashman. No wonder their defense is so good. What a what a game for the squad out here. Good run, Dylan. I can't play defense. That's that's the rules. Ooh, beautiful catch, MVS. Nice. Okay, guys, defense gets another stop. Unreal. Man, shout out to both the offense and the defense for this comeback. What, we were down 30 to nothing? I wonder what the odds would have been if you bet Packers here with that score. Plus 5,000. GG's, GG's. Wow. What's the, what's the old take? I can't see it on my end. that I was going to lose this game. Nah, we, we were never worried. Man, that was fun. Panda, you put 15k down that I was going to lose? Now I'm even happier that I won this.
The four interceptions obviously are not pretty, but... Still a hell of a game. Hopefully Judy was fine with what happened. I can't remember if we, we met his thresholds or not. Because he was not a big part of the comeback effort there. 